a moment of silence for eight minutes and 46 seconds in recognition of the loss of George Floyd. Eight minutes and 46 seconds was the time that people stood by as he laid there uh, briefly still alive. So we'll mention that. There I sat with San Antonio District 2 Councilwoman Jada Andrews Sullivan in silence. Our interview about the protests against racial injustice cut short by an unexpected yet powerful moment. I hear my babies. You try to be the elected official, but at the same time, you're your mother. And your mother first. But that amen is just reminds you of how much you love. Eight minutes and 46 seconds doesn't sound like a whole lot of time, but in silence, it's an eternity. That moment of silence happened during a council meeting Andrew Sullivan was participating in from home. Her reaction told me all I needed to know about her, but she had more to say. So I went back two days later. On that trip, I met a baker. Get to whip up all the flavor. Whip it up, whip up all the flavor. And an influential mom. How would you describe your mom in three words? Smart, goofy. independent, and goofy. Is that true? Is that true? I am. <laughs> but that empathy that I saw before was replaced with passion. Passion to help. If we don't allow what we've been through to uplift somebody else so they don't have to go through it, then what are we doing? Passion for change. Until we see real change, we're not stopping. We're not stopping. No more when we do it for two weeks and then it's over. No more when we do it after this hashtag and then we wait for the next. Jada Andrews Sullivan is a lifelong San Antonio. I'm right here with you because this is the same street that I have been on since I've been here for the last 44 years. Jada Andrews Sullivan is the only black member of San Antonio City Council. Great, thank you so much for coming. Thank you for having me. Jada Andrews Sullivan is a leader, a baker, and a mother who's ready to fight, a battle that's been a long time in the making. I'm here to stand with you. I have no problem fighting with you, and I definitely have no problem speaking up for what's right.